Hi everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. First of all, before I start this video, we recently reached 1,000 subscribers and I just wanted to mention how thankful and grateful I am for that. I am so, so grateful for every single one of you that has subscribed to my channel and I'm going to be doing a full-on video giveaway that is going to be separate from this video, so stay tuned for that so that you can enter. But for today's video, I'm going to be doing a very exciting video. So as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be reviewing and kind of just trying out the new Rare Beauty products by Selena Gomez. I'm I'm so excited because I'm a huge, huge fan. I love Selena Gomez, if you didn't know already. <laughs> so I'm super excited to share with you guys what I think about them, how I, if I like them or not. So just my honest opinion and let's get right into the video. I'm gonna use the Liquid Touch Multitasking Sponge. This is one of the products that I found and I'm super excited to try this. Okay, so the foundation that I'm gonna try is the Liquid Touch Fond de Taint Impersible, I believe it's called. I picked the shade 290N, so I'm hoping that this is my shade. I, be I based this off based on another foundation and my shade for that one, so hopefully this works out. This is my first time opening this right now. I've seen the packaging in photos, but this looks really cute. I really love the little thing right here, the circular thing at the top. I think it's really cute. Um, it looks kind of dark, but we're gonna try it out and see if this works out. I really like this brush. It feels really soft. Um, this looks pretty dark for me, so it might not be my shade, which makes me really sad. But um, we're gonna try and hopefully we can blend this in. But hopefully we can blend this and make it work. Um, this feels really light though i'm not gonna lie it feels super light on my skin okay so i feel like this is definitely a darker shade than i thought but i think we are making it work i think it's kind of like blending in pretty well for the sponge i really like how soft it is i do appreciate that i also really appreciate this top little pointy portion of it because it really allows me to just go in under my eyes and to really blend kind of like the smaller parts of my face the next thing that i really want to try is this this is the brow harmony crayon and gel surcils in cool brown i really wanted to pick this out because i have been searching still for the best eyebrow pencil or just eyebrow product that can really help me with my brows because i don't really know how to like manage them i don't know i struggle so we're gonna open it right here on one side it's got the little gel i love how small this is because i preferably for my eyebrows i have pretty thin eyebrows so i don't feel like i need a huge um eyebrow brush and then on the other side we're gonna open it as well A little bit goes a long way with this because I see that the more or the harder that I press on like uh, my eyebrows tend to um, look thicker we're gonna use a little gel portion of this now I'm really excited to see how this feels I am NOT a makeup expert by the way I'm just kind of like okay a lot goes a long way here too so we're just gonna brush them over I could also just use the gel instead of just the both of them so the next thing that i'm going to try out from the things that i picked out is the illuminizer i'm so excited for this this is the positive light liquid luminizer this is the mesmerize one i believe is the name so this i noticed also has a similar packaging to the foundation this is so pretty so it looks like this it's really really cute i really again appreciate this i feel like it just makes it super easy to open and this color looks so beautiful you guys it looks so so pretty just dab little dots oh that was a lot little dots just on my cheekbone i don't really want to use the little brush that comes inside just because i feel like it might come out like too much so i just don't really want to put too much on me so i'm just blending this in with my fingers which honestly helps with like a natural kind of look so i do appreciate that okay so i did a quick little eye look super simple and also i added mascara but i'm just gonna add oops. <laughs> i'm just gonna add a little bit of this under my eyebrows too 
I'm still loving the fact of how light this foundation is because that's honestly what I've been wanting for the longest time, just a light foundation so that I don't feel like my face is feeling cakey or just too much makeup because I feel like a lot of the foundations make me feel like they're super, I don't know, heavy and stuff. So I really appreciate that. I still feel like I could possibly not have makeup on. So it feels really, really nice and light so far. The last thing that I'm going to share with you guys is the With Gratitude Dewy Lip Balm. This is a hydrating, fuss-free balm that adds a hint of just kissed color and soft, soft shine, soft shine. Um, this looks really cute. This is definitely different packaging overall than most of the other products so i'm gonna open it real quick it just goes up like this and it is a little lipstick so we're gonna see how this feels on and i'm gonna try and be careful so that i'm not totally messing up this lip look this smells so good first of all um second of all I love this. This feels really nice on my lips. It's really, it feels like hydrating, kind of like a lip balm basically, which is I guess what they were trying to go for. Okay, so I think by far the two products that really stand out the most, most for me are definitely the lipstick. It feels super soft on my lips and it looks really nice. I really love the color and it's super glossy and shiny, so I really like that. I also love the packaging, super cute. And the other thing that really stands out to me is the foundation. I really love how light it is on my skin. I don't feel any heaviness or feel like I have a bunch of makeup on. Like I really feel like I might even forget that I have makeup on because I don't feel a lot of makeup on my face. So I really like that. So I'm excited to just keep you guys updated on all the products that I'm trying out and see if I continue to like them and all that stuff. But I will link all the products that I got down below. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe down below if you haven't already, and let me know if you have tried out any of these products or just your intake on any of this. Definitely look out for a video next week and for a giveaway video coming very soon, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.